Hi, everybody. We're back. Look, Can you believe it? I, I can't. I, you know, Sky, you were out of commission. I know. I had a little back surgery, guys. You I all fucked I, up. I was so bad, I couldn't even sit on the chair. But I have to ask you the, 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 the biggest question. When they knocked you out, when they did the Michael Jackson shit on you, <laughs> did you like it? You know what? I, I was a little nervous about mm -hmm. that stuff, but I did like it, actually. I yeah. felt like it's I had the, a few drinks. If, if For anybody out good. there who has not had surgery, it's the best fucking sleep you it ever It was did. great. And when I woke up from the anesthesia, I was mm -hmm. like... Who's talking to me? Like, leave <laughs> like, me the like, fuck alone. Let me sleep longer. I want to sleep. Right. That's yeah. how I was. Like, anyway, get the fuck I'm back and I can actually sit again. Now, we're back. Guys, we had a two-week hiatus. Um, I got to start out with the mystery celebrity. Because we, we obviously haven't had a lot of hints for December. We had one hint. The mm -hmm. first hint uh, for the month of December I know. Was, we need to hurry this shit up now because the month of December is going to be over soon. It is. But because it's the month of December... Because we haven't been able to give everybody a bunch of hands. because we were out of commission. And because we're in the holiday spirit, we're going to award two prizes. <gasps> Ooh! That's two fingers, see? I'm not giving you fuckers the peace sign, huh? How much? Both $100 gift cards. <gasps> wow! First person generous. with the correct answer. Second person with the, the correct, correct answer. answer. That's awesome. $200 gift cards from Amazon. Wait, you have $100 to, each. $100 a piece. Each. And they have to email. Now, people who are new to this... You, you fuckers put shit on the comment board yeah, that, and put it in my ass. That's not going to work, okay? It's, none of Email that Email him right here. Kevin at the KevinWhiteShow.com. That's where I have to have the correct answer in order for mm -hmm. you to win, um, to be eligible. Now, the first hint for the month of December was what? Mel Singer. The second hint for the month of the, uh, December is decades. <laughs> <laughs> I know not, that's not a not lot. We're not making it hard. Yeah, yeah I, I know that that's not giving you guys a lot, but you know what? You guys are digging up in my fucking wallet, okay? So I'm not going to make it easy for that's you That's right. We now, might not have to give any away. If happy birthday, gets... Brad Pitt. 50. Can you believe that he's shit? A good looking, he's, he's a good looking guy for 50 years old. He looks he really, great. He looks great. He, yeah. he does. And he, he definitely got a score in and Angelina he's got Jolie. Like, he's got like 20 kids. At least. Yeah. At least. Which is going to make him look like he's 60 in about another couple of you years. You would but, think, but he doesn't. But he's still, he's still, he's still a good looking guy. Now, um, the next thing I want to talk about is everybody out there has a smartphone. Everybody yes. has an iPhone. And everyone's or a Galaxy on there note. all day, beep, beep, beep. everywhere they are, in the car, everywhere. So yeah. it brought me, I was curious. Yeah. And, and you were curious to see, like, what are the most popular apps? I know. For 2013, because it's constantly fucking changing. For everybody. smartphones and iPads. But this one was just for smartphones, actually. Oh, okay. I think you thought it was for iPads, too, but oh. there were some different ones You know, for maybe the anesthesia is still in my head, you, and I'm you not You could still have, do you straight. feel woozy? I might. Do you feel vulnerable? I'm just saying. <laughs> How but, uh, advantage but, uh, me? Yeah, you, you don't want me sitting in the all studio right. of old dirty Kevin, so, uh. All right. Now. We're going to go through a list of the most top popular ten. We love lists on the Kevin White Show. We do. We do lists out of control. And yeah. uh, and, then, and coming in at number 10 was what do you think? Despicable Me. Who gets that at? Minion Rush. You know, I have to. I, ha, I don't I even, didn't even see the I second movie. I haven't even seen the movies. Any of them. The first movie was great. I'm, I, I'm not going to front and act like I'm fucking, you know, Mr. Cool Soul Brother here. I love that shit. You did? And I'm actually upset that I didn't see the movie. Well, you might want to download this app because it's all the little minions and it's actually like a little game. Like Merry fucking Christmas! <laughs> That's the biggest mug I've ever seen. How is it that way? Holy shit. I don't know, shit. but I almost ripped my fucking bicep. Oh though. my god. So, uh, <laughs> anyway, Despicable Me app is actually a game with the little minions and, mm -hmm. and they do like little things. Like what? Like, like it's like... Uh, Rob Banks? Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> You were so quick to say that. I was, you're like, yeah, they do that shit. Do you have it on no. your phone? The question is, Scott, you know do you what? Have it no, on your... but I looked it up, and mm -hmm. it actually, you know, they just have to do little missions, the missions? little minions. Yeah. Okay, everybody, I want to know who watches the show. Who has the Despicable Me? Look, Jesus can you Christ. not talk? What is going Despi on? What's in my eggnog? Uh, is... The Despicable Me app. <laughs> now, coming in at number nine, and I do have this app. I have it too. Pandora Radio. Yeah, I like it. Uh, it's cool. It's a great app. Uh, yeah, especially because you can get special stations, and I have the Britney Spears station. <laughs> get the, I do. Who gets a fucking Britney? Are you serious? I do. I you work the, out to it, and it's all Britney. I love it. The Britney Spears and station. And the 80s. Yeah. I got the 80s too. That just tells you how old you I know, am. You know, I'm thinking about going back to using the Pandora uh, application because I, I have my phone, all my music from my iTunes, mm -hmm. and I kind of, when I'm in the gym working out, I use it, but... It's and I use the genius mixes, but uh, it it always fails on me. I, I but can't. I think if you use Pandora, it's using your streaming and, right. and you're paying for for it. I'm gonna try that the next time in the yeah. gym. But anyway, at whatever the case, everybody, it came in at number nine. Now yeah. number eight was an app that I also have, and everybody probably on the planet has. Although it wasn't the most popular. Except download. for me, 
I don't have it. Facebook, yeah. I don't have it. Facebook. Can you believe Sky yeah. doesn't have a Facebook? I'm not on Facebook. I don't have a Facebook. I don't have time for Facebook. Um, no. Yeah. So you don't. You don't have Facebook. No, You're like fuck for Facebook. What? You know. Facebook. Obviously, no. a lot of people. Um, I, I do have the app. I get aggravated with the app because I'm like, okay, this fucking thing's loading. And for some people, for another people, always think I'm on well, Facebook. Maybe and I'm you like, need to I'm update. Never on. Maybe you need to update your smartphone. I do. Is it a little slow? Why are you telling everybody how fucking old my smartphone is? That's what you want to do, Sky. Go ahead. Look, go ahead and tell them how, like, I have, like, an iPhone 2 and a half. You do? I don't know what the fuck. It's old as Does shit. That I don't even have don't Siri, know. everybody. I don't even have Siri. Holy shit, man. I Holy love Siri. shit. I love Merry it. Christmas. I love Siri. Yeah, I don't have her. Siri's my bitch. Never met her, never been she out on a date with her. She texts and emails for me. She's my bitch. Yeah. <laughs> we'll see I'm how getting good ready you. for Street Yeah, you are. I can see you're prepping for Street Slang yeah. 101. Now, number seven was Instagram. Which I love I it. I love Instagram. I love it. Instagram is one of my favorite apps. I love it. I, I, I follow know, everybody. Yes. My sister <laughs> actually turned me on this a long time ago. She was like, you've never heard of Instagram? Instagram yeah. is awesome. She's like, shh, shh, shh. It's fucking the best app well, in the nice world. Well, it's nice because you you get to look at pictures, but you don't have to talk to people. Yeah, it's and, nice. And 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 that's what I, I don't, the Facebook shit gets to be too much. Yeah, I like Instagram. I don't have uh, most of the people that I follow on Instagram will follow me are people that I'm actually friends with, not just you know the the fake friend shit that's on Facebook where everybody has like three thousand friends and they don't know any of them bitches. Oh yeah, I don't want strangers following me. Yes, <laughs> number six, Snapchat. You know what? I don't have that, I don't either. but I know what it's all about. I do too. Because I watch the news. So I'm up to date, man. And you deliver it's a bunch of teenagers. It. Mm -hmm. It's a bunch of teenagers that snap themselves naked and then you get to see it for like several seconds. You can set it to like three or five seconds and yeah. then it erases, right? Yeah. So they're like, Oh, I'm gonna you send a little private. That shit. Yeah, that's what they do. See, this is the thing. The it's fucking generation thing. now okay, I'm gonna tell you guys, and I know we have a lot of you guys that watch you guys are just fucking fucked up like you guys do everything you <laughs> take social pictures media. you know it's, it's like this is what it'll do they'll be like you can't even fucking lie about shit without getting busted you fucking idiots like they'll go well i'm not gonna go do that then they'll say well, well, well what are you gonna do i don't know man i'm just gonna sit at home and chill the fuck out and then they'll go Instagram, check themselves and they'll up. say like whatever location right at, or... they'll check themselves in they're like oh motherfucker i thought you were staying at home yeah. or they'll fucking yeah you guys you guys that social just, media shit will follow you around it will, and, and it'll, give it away it'll get you fucking busted you know yeah. and they don't put all your shit up there so your parents could see that shit nobody wants to see i'm a parent i don't want to see what the fuck no. i don't want to even follow my fucking kids i'm like you know what you just no, I'm not going to follow you or fuck do any of your shit. You I might, don't know yeah, you might have a heart attack. Now, this is something. Number five. Uh, Google Maps. Yeah, I love Google Maps. Because awesome, you need man. that shit. I fucking get lost everywhere. I love it. I like Google Maps. It's great. It's great. Mm -hmm. but I like where it. am I at? Where, <laughs> where am I at now? Right. Google Maps. Number That was number five. Number four is. Fine. <laughs> Vine. You like I love Vine. Vine. I do I like love Vine. It. Vine got really popular. It gets in annoying if you watch too many in a row because there's such crazy shit on there. Nobody watches more Vines than my daughter. She is out of control with that shit. It's she hilarious. Loves Vines? She loves It's. It, I don't know what she would do without Instagram and Vine. Really? Yeah, she goes fucking crazy with that shit. Yes. Vine is great. It's you know, good. We'll have, we have a Vine. We'll have to do a Vine after the show. We will have to do a Vine. Yeah, Guys, look for a Vine. Because it's short and funny. It is. Now, number three is Temple Run 2. Not Temple Run Run. Not Temple Run 1. Oh, my God. That's a tongue twister. Say that fast. Temple Quasi. Run 1. Temple Run, run 1. Temple Run 1. Three times. <laughs> you sound like fucking Astro. <laughs> Temple Run 1. Um, Temple Run 2 was popular. It, it was the third it, most downloaded. Another video app. game where you're running over. I have no idea what it, it is. It's like you're running. It looks like you're in, like, ruins. Like, buildings falling apart and you're running. Like during that's the Inca I, period or something. Yeah, like I, that. I don't know. I don't, I don't, know I don't play is. these games. I don't know. Uh, the number two most downloaded app, downloaded app is YouTube. I love it. I have it. You guys it. can actually be watching show. this one. I yeah. check our comments. Yeah. YouTube is good. The new app was a son of a bitch for a while because there was a lot of weird stuff going on and people were complaining. And now that they've migrated this new comment system in, some yeah. people are not too pleased with it. But I think for the most part, everybody doesn't do good with change initially and then they adapt yeah. to it. Now, number one, is, I don't have it. And can you believe it? I'm gonna, I'm gonna put it on my phone. You're I not have gonna to have check a, it out. You're not gonna have a life if you put How it do you your, know that? You're, you're not gonna have a life. You know, everybody who has Number this app one is Candy Crush Saga. Can I just tell you? Mm -hmm. I, I was just hanging out with my mom because she was here helping me after my surgery. She was Merry her, Christmas. She She was my mom was on her iPad. I'm like, what are you doing? She's playing that Candy Crush game.
I don't know what it is. I'm going to have to check it out. I'm a big fan of Tetris, but this is all candy. I'm going to have to check it out. Tetris with candy figures? That could be good. Yeah. I don't play Candy Crush. I don't play any of those things. When I was on Facebook, well, I, I'll people let you know how it is. wanted if, to invite me to play Mafia Wars. I'm like, stop with that shit already. Oh, yeah. I, 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 I couldn't right. do it. Anybody have Candy Crush? Mm -hmm. Tell me how it is. I'm going to go try it. Yeah, Candy Crush. So yes. I, I am done with that. Now. Guess what? Since we're in the holiday spirit and yeah. you're drinking that giant mug of eggnog. Okay. I got some holiday make a choice, bitch. Kevin will be the holiday bitch. Yay! It's fun! I got Bring it a lot! On. You ready? Everybody! These are corny holiday questions, guys. I'm going to run through these fucking songs. Okay, ready? Okay, let's go. One. Okay. Would you rather have to sing the chorus of Jingle Bells every time you walk into a room for a week, mm -hmm. right? So every time you walk in, you got to sing Jingle Every Bells. fucking room? Every, every time. Gee, you know, it's a lot or of Or wear a Santa suit to work for a week every day. Santa suit. Really? Yeah. I'd wear the Santa suit. I'd sport that mug. They'd probably be You'd like... You'd rock that shit? They'd probably be like, I don't know what, who, where that Negro Santa Claus came from. <laughs> Kids would be like, that's not Santa. <laughs> <laughs> He's not, you know what I'm saying? They'd be like, so what's wrong with Santa? You have to stuff he a little pillow He went to the Caribbean, motherfucker, there. and got a good tan. No, I mean... Yeah, what now? Santa suit? You'd have to put a pillow underneath for your yeah. tummy. Oh, since cool. you don't have one. Yeah, but I could, I could, I could, I could. Okay, so some. Santa suit. Santa suit. Question number two: Would you rather make presents for your family instead of buying them, mm -hmm. or make all your own ornaments for your tree instead of buying them? So make ornaments or make presents. Are you crafty? I probably want to make ornaments. Really? Yeah. Because I just those what little kind of like shit would foam. You hang on your tree? I've made ornaments in the past. You have? Yeah, when I was a kid, when I was a child, I used to make them. Um, you get that little styrofoam ball and you would press the little like uh, in sequence there? in it. Yeah. Oh wow! Yeah, so Fancy. I can make some fucking ornaments. I'm fucking. I got some arts and crafts up. You're in this crafty. Thing. I'm crazy. Yeah, I'm crazy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, go. All ahead. right. Would you? Question number three. No Christmas or no birthday this year. No birthday. I don't need a fucking reminder I'm getting crusty as shit. <laughs> Fuck that. Give me my presents. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, for Christmas, you get presents too. Happy birthday. You're your older motherfucker. No, I, yeah, Christmas. Because hey, you celebrate that with everyone. With the family. Yes. Yeah. That's great. All right. Number four. This, I told you these were corny questions, okay. but they're cute. Okay? okay. Would you rather have Frosty the Snowman as your friend or oh. Rudolph? That's a dumb question. I know what I would say. Fucking Frosty, man. No. Happy birthday. Rudolph's a Rudolph's so cute. You can pet him and hang out with him. Rudolph's a fucking asshole. He's the half the size of He's the ring. He's not an asshole. He's cute. He is fucked up. He has no... Look, you got Blitzen and Con Con Donner and Cupid and Vixen and all those other reindeer that are big as fuck. They've been pulling a sleigh. Here comes Rudolph with the birth defect because he's got a red fucking nose. Now he's got his own fucking show. Do any of the other reindeers have another show? I have a very big problem with Rudolph. I like Frosty. Really? I follow you on Instagram and you posted Rudolph on your Instagram. Because it, it, it was a little deer and it was so fucking adorable. It was in my backyard. <laughs> and me and the deer are kicking it out. I say, hey, the deer's cool as shit. I like him, but he's not Rudolph. All right. Okay, five. Ready okay, for five. this? Right. Would you rather have Christmas tree tinsel, you know, that silver stuff, <laughs> for your hair? Right, okay. Or have fingernails that light up for Christmas? Tinsel. I'd be like you Rick have, James, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And that silver hair oh, blooded. Yeah, I would I would. I would I would have You'd that. rock that? I would rock that shit like I was fucking playing for Def Leppard. <laughs> I like Def Leppard. Yeah, they, they were, Def like Leppard was the shit in the eighties. It just gives away how old we are. Yeah. Anyway. You know? mm -hmm. All right. Number six. Okay. Only eat fruitcake for two days. Fuck no. Fruitcake only. I fucking hate fruitcake. Okay. So I, that's the or answer. Uh huh. Candy canes. God. Nothing else. Candy canes. Candy canes or fruitcake? Candy canes. Really? Because fruitcake's got that hard oh, shit that looks like fucking... it's got fucking liquid oh, in it. Oh, it's delicious. Fruits and it's nuts. Terrible. It's feel good. I would eat fruitcake, man. Fuck that. It's got liquor. For in how it. long is it? Two days. Fruitcake. You get fruit, I'd nuts, and liquor. I'd be all fucking geeked out on fucking sugar, but I have to have the candy cane. Candy I fucking canes? hate fruitcake, man. Fruitcake oh, is delicious. rotten. Well, I'm not a big fan, but it's got I alcohol hate it. in it. I'm not like a lot of you guys. Okay. All right, number seven. We're almost there, guys. I did a lot today. I see. Right? Yeah. I, because I was gone. Because you're in the holiday spirit and you had to make up for it. You know. I had to make up for it. I was, yeah. you know, you resting me. and thinking of shit. Okay, ready? Mm -hmm. Would you rather have a nose that glows red like Rudolph? No. Or have pointy elf ears? Pointy elf ears. Would you just 
grow your fur for how long? To cover it? It doesn't say. It's just that, that's just my rule. Yeah, However, I would just I would have the pointy elf. Would you ears. rather have your nose slide up? No, because then you're walking around with a fucking red nose, and everybody's like, someone's fucking like cracking your nose, Kevin. I'm just like, so I'm if a you had elf. the pointy ears, would you grow an afro? I possibly, possibly, <laughs> I possibly could rock some '70s shit. All I right, grow an afro. Okay, last one. You ready? Yes. Would you rather? Get a hundred dollars for Christmas to mm -hmm. buy yourself something, or a thousand dollars for Christmas to buy gifts for everybody else. Oh yeah, definitely a thousand dollars to give everybody stuff. I don't give a shit about giving crap. I agree. You know, it's it's, it's better fun to, to buy, to isn't it? Huh? I love giving. It is. It's it's, it's such a good feeling when you yeah, give. Yeah, that's why we give away two gift cards. All now, right, that was it. Okay, guys, it's time to move back onto the show, and let me before we get into this segment. It's it's a list that we came across. We we found about the worst, the top ten worst movies. Which is kind of debatable. It is debatable. I think it's it, kind of funny. It's debatable. I'd like to hear the, what everybody says. Yeah, it was the top ten worst movies for 2013. And Sky and I kind of looked at the list. And I'm like, I didn't think that was that bad. And we we found, but well, some of these, them I, I've seen. These were people that put together a list, and uh, and we of course we have to fucking bring it to you guys, but. It's not our list, okay? It's not our list. So any of you Hollywood actors or actresses that are out there, it, we're not fucking rolling any of you guys under the bus if you participate in any of these movies, okay? No. We're not trying to fuck your fucking salaries up, but other people are, okay? Okay. So fuck it. So. Number 10, The Hangover 3. Shoot from, tell me honestly, what did you think? You saw it, didn't you? Not as good as the first two. It definitely wasn't as good as the first two. But enjoyable. I liked, I liked all of them. I definitely. Because you know why? Because I like that little fat Greek hairy guy. What's his what's name? His Say name? it really quick. Zach Galifianakis. Galifianakis, right. Great. I think he's just fucking funny and better than he does. Yeah, he, he does a good job. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is in What is in that? Can I taste that? Go ahead. What it's is it? Egg Holy egg. shit, this weighs 20 pounds. Hey, get back in shape. You haven't been able to work out or anything with your old back Holy problems. Holy shit, no, man. <laughs> Thanks, Felix. It's Unger. a problem. Um, okay, number so nine. So, Hangover. I, yeah, I agree with you. I didn't think it was good as the first two, but no. it was still a good movie. But the, old the Boy. The cast was good. Old Boy, you know, I never even heard of it. This Are was you? the movie with Spike Lee and Josh Brolin. And I've you know never what? heard of it. I, I, I heard about it when they were putting it together and doing everything. I didn't hear anything else about it. That doesn't mean that, that I could sit bad. there and it was bad. Was it in the movie theater? I, I mean, they just said, people just didn't seem to like it. Okay? Uh, and, and, and that's... You know, Spike and, and Josh, hey, yeah. you know what? I didn't see it, so I'm not going to tell you Tell you what. Grown Ups 2. I did not. Gr yeah, number eight was Grown Ups 2. You know what? I thought it was great. I, I love the Grown cast. Ups well, I saw, like, parts of it. I saw the first one. I saw parts Scott, of number two. why are you fronting? Oh, I thought it was great. Well, I didn't really see it. <laughs> well, I saw parts of it. Yeah, but you know what? It's got Adam Sandler, Kevin James, Chris Rock. Did you Rock. like the first one? I did. I like all the people in it. So how bad can it be? The first one was, this is, once again, I, the first one was not as good as I thought it was going to be. I, I, that's me being very honest. Was it funny? Yeah, it was funny. Um, I thought it was funny. It was funny. And I thought it was an entertaining movie. I thought it was a great movie. But. Well, I definitely don't think it was worse to be the top ten. No. Yeah, and that I didn't. Good. I didn't see Grown Ups too. Okay, and I probably won't see it. I mean, when it comes out, on I DVD, saw parts of it, but whatever, because it was on TV. So, oh, Grown Up Two. Yeah, it's on TV. Is that already. one already out? Yeah. See, that's not a good sign, everybody. It's already out. When your shit's out. out on DVD, like yeah. three days after it comes out I in the theaters. It. Oh, okay, yeah, that's probably not good. It's all right. The Canyons. Okay, this okay, was a kiss. Okay, Lindsay of. Lohan. Yeah. I, I had never even heard of this movie. It's like almost Have a you? soft porn. Yeah, I, I heard about it. What do you it. mean soft porn? It was Lindsay Lohan trying to make a comeback. It was the Canyons, and she was almost. It was like it dealt with like pornography or whatever. It was a Kickstarter project, and she was basically. It was almost like soft porn. Really? And, yeah, and uh and Did you I see didn't it? I didn't see it. I didn't see it, but I heard that it was rotten. Terrible. Really? Yeah. And, well what is it about? Hmm. Um I can't tell you because I don't oh. fucking know. Okay. I don't know. It says Anybody uh see it? Lindsay Lohan is just done. Okay. Yeah. The last movie I saw with her, she was playing a little bit. That's Taylor. what they're saying. They're saying that the supporting cast pretty much, you know, um fucked it up. And they're saying the script was plotting. I mean, it's, it's, it's just, it just didn't seem like they put a lot of time into it. Well, she was Elizabeth Taylor in this TV made movie. Yeah. That was good. Yeah. I liked it. She was a good Elizabeth it's, Taylor. You know, Elizabeth she, Taylor was a mess. And she probably said, you know what? Hey, fuck it. I'm going to get paid to do yeah. this. I'm going to do, I would, I would have fucking right. done it. Machete kills. I don't need to say anymore. You know what? All I know from that is that, that's that the I, no, I just, I saw, what's her name? That, that Spanish woman with the tits blowing. Colombian. Right. Colombia. Yeah. What? Oh, is that not the same movie? Yeah. Col Col yeah. What is that it? woman's uh, name? Now I can't remember. You made me have a, uh, uh, from, from fucking Modern Family. 
What's wrong with us? Sophia. Sophia Vargas. Vargas. Right. She's wearing these pointy things that shoot guns. That's all I know about that movie. I haven't seen it. I don't have any desire to see right. it. I think. It looks stupid. I think, you know, Rod Rodriguez was just like, you know what? He knew it was going to be this kind of movie. No one expected it to be a good was movie. Was it in the movie theater? It was in the movie theater. For a week? For probably a week. Maybe yeah. six days. No. And, uh, and no one expected it to be. That people bad? expect it to be in the theater for a few couple of weeks and then go right to, you know, mm -hmm. right to the store. So just the name. Yeah. Um Hansel and Gretel, the Witch Hunters came in at number I, five. I don't um, even know who's in it. I don't even know what Oh, Witch Magic Hansel was in it. Gretel? Jeremy Renner was in it. Remember? Jeremy well, I Renner. Know who, was, he is. who signed to What's do like What's wrong four. with him? Nothing's wrong with him because he's like, hey, you know what? No, I'm in I know. good movies. I'm in bad movies. I'm, he's like the new Tommy Lee yeah. Jones. I'm getting paid. All I know he's is like, Hansel and Gretel, my parents read Merry Christmas! Hansel and Gretel, my parents read to me when I was little growing up in Hollis and it scared the shit out of me and that's, I don't need to know the rest yeah, of that story. Yeah, it's about the fucking kids the get witch. lost. Mm -hmm. It's, no, Didn't she not. bake them like in an oven? Yeah, she tried to put them in an oven. It's not good. Did they get, did, did she cook them? No, I they threw her in the oven and burned her. Uh, and they, they put breadcrumbs in the forest to find their way home. Yeah. Because their parents didn't care about them. It's a bad, bad <laughs> story. <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> you turn this shit into Dr. Oz? <laughs> I mean, come on! You know it's what? a bad story. You know it scared the fuck out of me. I, I didn't the, like it. Huh? I watched a lot of Dr. Oz and Dr. Phil when I was resting uh, after my surgery. You need to back up off that shit. shit okay. Man. Number four, The Lone Ranger. You know, that's with Johnny Depp, and yeah. it looked like it was going to be cute. Like a di isn't it Disney? Uh, I think this is, when you get to the, some of these, these, these next few movies that we say, uh, the Lone Ranger, I think, because of Johnny Depp and because of the title, everybody gets these huge expectations for these movies. Yeah. You, you think that it is going to be a number one at the box office. Because it's, it's Johnny to... Depp and it's got great actors. Right. Yeah. And, and it fell short of that. So that's why I think these people put this on the list. Mm -hmm. I'm sure when it comes to, it's coming out very sooner. It might already be out on DVD or, you know, where you can get it on, uh, uh, pay per view. <laughs> I'm sure. <laughs> I'll watch it and like the you fucking are? movie. You know what I mean? I'll watch the fucking movie and like it, you know, because I'm sitting on my couch in the comfort of my home watching you it. You just watch like, whatever? And you know me. I get easily entertained. I can fucking watch dumb shit and be like, oh, that was fucking great, you know? Yeah. Now, number three was After Earth. Do you even remember this? Don't look. Don't look. Don't look at her nose. No, but I know what it is, but I haven't seen it. Who, it's who's with in it? Will Smith and right. his son. Now, and I'm it's a, like the Earth is gone and there's nothing left. That's all I know from the clip. The Earth is gone with nothing left. Now, looking at the movie, I haven't seen the movie, everybody. Um. It made number three on this list. Uh, obviously, like Why? I said before. Is it because it flopped in the movie theater? I think, once again, it flopped in, in contrast to what people thought the movie mm -hmm. was going to do. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. People think Will Smith, he's a huge box office draw. Yeah, I like after him. He's special great. effects out the ass. His son, Jaden, I mean, is a phenomenal actor, you know, young actor. And everybody thought, okay, wow, it, it's going to be huge. And it fell short of that. Yeah, because the two of them were in it. People so thought it was So it makes good. this list at it's number not. three. Number two, and I'm going to tell you what right now on this list. I'm going to fucking <laughs> totally agree, disagree, disagree. I know you love it. I want to punch. You told whoever, me about this. It, it's movie 43. I've seen okay, it too. movie 40. Just the first scene with fucking dude with the fucking nuts on his fucking. I chin. have to say, I love that it had some really big actors in there <laughs> right. that were willing to do the craziest Anything. shit because the first scene. Was what's his name? It's that, got that Hugh Jackman and Kate yeah. Winslet, and he's got a ball sack hanging from his chin. <laughs> he's sitting there with the ball sack out to dinner, <laughs> and it's like hanging in his soup when yeah. he's having dinner with her. And I Kate, know. And you know what? Just Kate that, Winslet's a great sport. She was, and you know what? I thought what was so great about the movie was is that exactly what you said. You got to see the other side of very serious actors. I know. They all the really are, big actors in that movie. And a they lot. all can be funny as shit. They're, yeah. they're that talented that they can play in a comedic role and, and deliver. And they were, it was funny as shit to see that. Yeah. And just to me, for some pe the people to put this second on the worst movies, yeah. I, I'm just like, okay. It was entertaining. It the was only entertaining. thing I didn't like is that ass scene <laughs> with the shitting. I, I'm sorry. That grosses me out. It was just I, so I, funny. My, Go That's see it, gross. everybody. It's fucked up. If you guys have seen it, leave us a comment. I want to see what you think. And you'll about just it. say how immature I am, but it's a great movie. It would have probably made my top ten. It would have. <laughs> now, <laughs> Best movie. Um, the number one one, which uh, I found which, this to be very entertaining. I did too. I was, thought it was good. 
fun. was a good day to die hard. With it was the well, yeah, maybe the final sequence. Then he might have ten more. Well, of these. no, but, because I think he's too old now. Bruce Willis, I'm sorry, but he's You're still done with it. this. But you know what? He's still doing it. Bruce and it was Will great. He's funny as shit. He's great. He he looks good. He did it, and and yeah. the plot was pretty good. I mean, the way they did it, because you would think, okay, they've been removed from the series for mm -hmm. a while. For them to come back, I thought it was. Those movies are always good to me. I thought it was great. I, don't know. I really thought it was great. Anyway, um, that was that's our movie our... selection. Since you guys are all going to be sitting home for the holidays and you'll watch some movies, if you watch any of these movies, leave us a comment. Yeah, and let us know what you guys think. I know. I don't and think. Tell us what you guys thought were the worst. Thing. Right. <clears throat> now, um, are you ready for some Street Slang 101? You fucking better believe Now, that. everybody, stop. I was born. It's ready. hammer time. Okay. <laughs> the, I know every, some people were like, oh, that was nice that you gave Scott. But. I got a lot of people in my inbox going, you're making it too easy for Scott. You know what? I saw those comments, guys. That is not cool. Hey, hey, whatever. You no, know. it's not so, cool. They're so, like, no, she shouldn't be allowed to ask for a sentence. Yes, I should. No, I'm a white no, girl. No, you're not. <laughs> I'm a white girl. What? I'm a, she's going to pull her white girl card. <laughs> I'm a white girl. <laughs> this is what we did. We're men to Okay, what are we doing? Okay. Um, I'm going to give you like a lifeline. And so you can say, I want to use my lifeline. And what does that mean? And that means I'll use it in a phrase. Okay. But only one Only one lifeline. out of four questions? Yes. Unless, yeah, one out of four questions. And the rest I'll just guess. You have to guess. And I'm going to tell you what. I, I brought it this week. There's oh, that's great. One. Okay. <laughs> Let's do this shit. Floss. Floss? Mm-hmm. It's a fucking G-string up my ass. That's what that is. Wrong! <laughs> <laughs> wrong, wrong, wrong. I, so I mean, I would have thought during your surgery you would have fucking just jumped on the dictionary and learned every ghetto fied, negro you know fied what? word in the world. I do follow ghetto whatever, ghetto it's something on Twitter. Uh -huh. And I learned some stuff. Floss is when you're showing off your wealth. Oh, man. I thought it was a G string. Floss shit. You know what I'm saying? Floss? What you the pull heck? up in your Bentley, you know, with your fucking diamond grills and your big butter, 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 ding, icy watch. And you and people are like, dude, it's flossing. Not this. That's what I do. Yeah, um, that's great that you floss. Don't look at the list. I see your eyes. I know. All right. Number two. Okay. In your lunch. In your lunch. Like in your face. It, what do you think? Because you got a little brother fight in your face. That's that was right. gonna make me. That was gonna make me say <laughs> <Yes>. you're right. <laughs> you're wrong. Do you guys know what it means in your in, in your lunch? It means no. being nosy. Really? Mm -hmm. What do you mean? Yeah, like man, dude's all up in my lunch. See, oh. see, see when I use it in a sentence, how it but it makes sense. <laughs> that's why you. you that's now, not cool. Two, that's not cool. The it's not cool it's that a, you guys are so against me that I can only use one. Don't hyperventilate. That's not it's nice. Okay. Look, look at this. You guys should be a little Breathe nicer in. to Breathe me. In. Breathe in. You all still right, got two bring chances. it on. Okay. Ready? Okay. <laughs> What was that? Was that a, okay? Okay. Are you from Canada now? Okay. Hold hey. on. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Spitball. Hot headed. No. <laughs> that was a good. I don't know where you came up with that one, but no, a spitball is like ah. Uh, he just gave me a spitball, and what it would cost? An oh. estimate. Spitball is an estimate. You know what I mean? Okay. This is not ghetto terms. This is not ghetto terms. It's, it's no, ghetto. Yeah, it's, it's not. Spitball. Who talks like that? Man, how much is that? Your car, it's, it's how you deliver it, Scott. You know what I'm saying? Man, my fucking tire, you know, went flat the other day and, man, dude gave me a spitball. Say, I'm coming back. Do people really hey. talk like that? Yeah, and this one definitely. Ready for the next one? Yes. Children. Who? Children. All right. Lifeline. Hello. <laughs> What? What the? Is that a word? Yeah. Uh, right. Do you want to use your lifeline? Yeah, because <laughs> it's the last one and right. I didn't use it. Okay. These goddamn children are working my nerves. <laughs> Kids. Right. No. Well. But I couldn't hear what you said. Children. That's not. <laughs> sure. You can't hear it because you have Caucasian ears. You know what I'm saying? Children. I had to these use children, my lifeline on that. These children are annoying the shit out of me. Children. I had to use my lifeline on that. Look, I don't tell Maybe you. Maybe you should pronounce I, it better. I, I don't. <laughs> Look, can you? This this is where you're proving the point. Maybe you should pronounce it better. You know, I can't pronounce children. How can I pronounce children? Any I don't better? know, but children. I didn't know what you were saying. You were you, saying it you, like that on purpose, you, so I didn't hear. You're salty because you didn't use your lifeline on the things earlier. You got to really use this. 
lifeline thing. You waited for the last one, and that was probably the. All right, so one. I got one right. One out of one out of four. Everybody, let us know how you did. We're getting the hell out of here. Yeah, next week we'll be back for our holiday show. Yeah, so you want to tune in? And we might have to drink a little spike drink for spike the occasion. Spike drink, some eggnog, and get dressed up. That's right. We'll be dressed up for the occasion. What will you be? Mm. It's a surprise. I don't know. What about you? Okay. Okay. Deuces. We'll see ya.